look, moving on to the the main the main topic of of this night. This is what prompted me to to do a, a quick live show uh, tonight. Let me talk a little bit about uh, Jason David Frank. Jason David Frank. I heard this morning. I was I was uh, out and about, and um, I think I was on my way to go see my kids, go pick them up. I didn't really introduce them to the Power Rangers. I I I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I might get emotional on this. I never met the man, and I've always wanted to. Let me start off with with my Green Ranger story. I was a huge fan of of the uh, of the Power Rangers. I'm a 42 year old man about to cry about a man I've never met, but this is how much the Green Ranger meant to me. Um, was it middle school? Maybe was it middle school? I'm a fan of the Power Rangers, but when the story came to the Green Ranger. When the when the previews were all upcoming, this whole five day saga is gonna be five episodes introducing this new ranger. I'm like, who is this guy? This guy's cool. Let me tell you what my uh, my my dumb butt did when I was a kid. I skipped school. <laughs> I was supposed to, I was I was uh, what do they call a latchkey kid? You know, my mom went to work in the morning. Uh, my brother went to school, and I walked to school, uh, drive my brother off to school, I guess, and then I was supposed to walk myself to school, uh, but I didn't. I, I, I doubled back around, I came back home, and I, I stayed home all day, just so I wouldn't miss the episode when it come on. I could have watched it later. You know, I could have, but I wanted to watch it in real time when it aired. I don't know what the heck I was thinking. I did it for, for a week straight. I missed a week of school to watch the Green Ranger. I don't know what the hell I was thinking. And it was the best, one of the best weeks of my life. My mom to this day still does not know I did this. And ever since then, I've been a Tom, uh, uh, a Green Ranger fan. Even when, as an adult, I, I lost touch with all the, the, the Power Ranger stuff. But when I heard that he was back and that uh, it was at the Dino Thunder uh, episodes, I watched that whole thing and it made me feel like a kid again. I, when I watched the, mo the, the movie, and I feel like that movie was unappreciated, his cameo with him and the Pink Ranger. Um, there's a lot of drama that's going on with a lot of the Power Rangers. One, the, the, the one former Ranger that went to jail for what he did to his roommate. Uh, Jason, the Red Ranger, uh, his financial issues, a lot of drama. Uh, the Yellow Ranger, oh, what happened to her, man? Oh man, watch the Crow, dude. That that her performance, man. I feel like she was gonna be a mega star. A lot of tragedy with these with these actors. And to hear how he he passed was was hard for me. And uh, this. Uh, let me see if I can pull up a little bit uh, of what uh, of what uh, went down. So let me go to this graphic uh, real quick, so I can stop being a little emotional uh, on it. Let me go full screen. Uh, Jason David Frank is best known as Tommy Oliver for the original run of the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers franchise, dating back to the kids series debut in 1993. I was 13. Starting out as the Green Ranger in season one, Frank starred as one of the leads for three seasons, totaling 123 episodes, reprising his role as Tommy in several adaptations of the Power Rangers, including Wild Force, Turbo, Zeo, Dino Thunder, Mega Force, Ninja Steel, Hyper Force, and more. He's been a Red Ranger, a Black Ranger, and a Green Ranger. Jason David Frank is a fan favorite, a super mega fan favorite Power Ranger, which is why he's returned uh, to the franchise time and time again. There was even a time where um, there was even a time when uh, he was asked about it was that uh, I'm sorry it was that fan made 
thing about uh, like what an adult an R rated version of Power Rangers. He was real passionate about Power Rangers. He even got on live and he was like, "Look, man, I don't no, I don't think that's I don't think uh, that's a good idea." I, I I was mad at him for that. I was like, "Come on, man, the Power Rangers need to grow up." But I I respect his conviction. He loved that series. And I and I looked a little bit uh, further into it. TMZ, um, they they had their their uh, another story about how he was about to go through a, a divorce, and I'm not gonna speculate that that uh, maybe the pressures of the anger. I've been I'm, I'm a divorcee. I've been through a divorce. It's very it's very rough, man. It's very emotional, but. With all the pressures and all the things that's going on in the world, man, I, I, I wish that I'm glad that I had people to talk to. I'm glad that I had uh, counseling. I'm glad that I had friends, loved ones that that got me through it. It's it's a very uh, dep uh, depressing and emotional thing, especially whatever in whatever mental state that you're in. It's it's only gonna it's gonna it's only gonna add more weight and more pressure on it, man. And I'm not saying one thing is related to the other. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't, I don't know. But all that out of the way, Jason David Frank, Mr. Green Ranger himself, man, he his impact in my life was was huge. Uh as a creative person, as an artist, I, I draw as a as a uh all a lot of things that I did, I, I I can I can link a lot of the things that I've done creatively to a, a lot of the work that that man uh, put in as the Green Ranger, just as the Green Ranger alone. I mean I know every I mean people debate who's better the White Ranger the Green Ranger. I'm a Green Ranger man. I've always been. It's always been about the Green Ranger, his sacrifice that he uh, that he put into that show, man. And then again, uh, and then I think it was confirmed again in Dino Thunder when he uh, when he had to go through a trial where he had to fight all of his other previous uh, uh, you know Rangers, and uh, as a as and and he said it himself, you know how powerful he, the Green Ranger was saved for last. You know how powerful I'm, the most powerful one, it's the Green Ranger all day every day, man. I think even Tommy said that himself. I think I even saw him in an episode of uh, Family Matters. He played a, a uh, one of the thugs that was uh, fighting against uh, Steve Bruce Lee. Steve, <laughs> hello, Bruce. Okay, Bruce. I think he was one of those thugs that uh, Steve Urkel had to fight against. But coming all this way, uh, watching the Green Ranger as a child, uh, as a teenager. And looking up to that character, man, and and appreciating what what he put in, the work that he put in, and seeing how much it meant to him throughout his adult life, and how much he 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 really put it, it put it out there for the fans. I'm sorry that that he seemed to be a kind of a, a man that that didn't that felt like this was his only way out from whatever pressures that he was going on. And I, I know people are gonna talk and people are gonna speculate. On what it was about, maybe his uh, his his wife uh, that he was divorcing, maybe she might make a statement. Um, friends, friends and family. Um, so whatever he was battling and struggling with, um, it, it 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 devastates me, man. I wish, and if anybody out there is going through the same thing or anything similar, please please seek uh, uh, help and um, and 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 talk with somebody before doing uh, anything like this. Um, but Jason David Frank, I believe at the age of 49, uh, says, uh, it's gonna be, he's, he's gonna be missed, dude. I, I, I really, I did really get emotional about it, about hearing about it, because he meant a lot uh, to me as a child. He was one of my heroes. And I'm sorry, to, and I'm sad that, it, that, that it's ended like this for him. This is Power Rangers, man. They, this is a sad story for a lot of them, man. So uh, here's to the Green Ranger. Uh, I wish I could play the music, um, but I can't. It'll get, it'll get demonetized. You people be wondering why? Why are you, Chris? Why are you getting so emotional about this dude, man? I, I'm telling you, man. I skipped school to watch this dude. It, 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 he, the Green Ranger, meant something to me, and uh, I'm sad that he's gone. I, I, he was one of the dudes that I've always wanted to meet. 
So uh, say what you want to say about Bridge. If you're if you're not subscribed, you won't be able to comment. So if you got something to say, say it. Uh, please hit the subscribe button and uh, let me know what you guys think about Jason David Frank. Um, any any fond episodes? Any memories uh, for those who are, who out there who have ever met him at conventions and stuff? Man, I want to hear it all. I want to hear it. any story that you got. I want to hear it, and uh, maybe we'll talk about it later on the show.